Hey folks, what's up? Welcome back to another Pokemon Master video. And today you can check out the new Pound Lines Marnie and Mega Mawile, which uh, we uh, we just pulled, right? Which is very, very nice. Uh, go check out the some of these guys haven't already, right? Somewhere on the channel. So very, very nice in my opinion, right? So, anyways, uh, that aside, so uh, yeah, let's check it out. So, um, thankfully, this week we actually do have a Steel Week stage to coincide with uh, obviously Pound Lines Marnie uh, debuting in the game. Uh, so that's always fantastic to actually have a stage to use her in. So um, that's good. Uh, anyways, uh, we're going to... Obviously, she is a Steel Youth Zone user, and she helps a lot of uh, Steel-type units, but we're just going to try her out by herself just to see how well she could... Um, you know, how well she could uh, perform if she's the sole focus of the offense, right? So uh, we're going to run Power Posture over here, Super Duper Effective. Uh, three over here, Aggravation, Pecking Order, and uh, Mugu Refresh on Iron Head. Uh, we could also try a Sync Nuke, uh, fully Sync Nuke grid, uh, as well, because she is the second strongest Sync Nuke in the game, right? Uh, which is very, very nice, uh, in my opinion, at least. So, uh, yeah, she's, uh, she's a fantastic unit, right? Not only she's a, is she a Steel Zone setter, but even outside of, like, setting Steel Zone, I'd say she's probably one of the better Zone setters, uh, because of, again, all the other stuff she does outside of, uh, Steel Zone. Um, she's pretty good in mass mode, right? But I think where she really shines is Legendary Gauntlet, uh, because not only does she have the second strongest Sync Nuke in the game, which, uh, obviously for Legendary, uh, for Legendary Gauntlet, sync, strong Sync Nukes are really, really powerful, right? Um, but, you know, not only just that, uh, she has Flinch on Iron Head, 6% chance of, for Flinch with Aggravation is obviously fantastic. She debuffs the opponents, which, um, debuffs especially, you know, defense debuffs in, in longer battles are just so so powerful right in comparison to shorter battles uh what else um solid dps again very very good sync nuke oh the other thing is she does have team crit buffs uh as a non-support so that's always valuable saves you a support in one of your runs right which is uh, again um very very valuable so uh let's uh let's get into this let's try it against lance again just gonna make her the sole focus of the offense first and then we could you know, maybe try some other stuff uh later right so all right, let's see. Uh, let's see how this goes here. Let's uh, get one train move in first. We could, I guess growl while we're at it. Um, max that out. So, you know, super effective up as well, which I guess would be nice. All right, there's the growl. Set up a uh, steel zone, steel wish here. Get some uh, extra defense downs. And yeah, as you guys can see, on entry she gives your whole team plus one crit, right? Gives your whole team plus one crit. Uh, gives the opponent, you know, minus uh, two attack and minus two defense. And the other great thing is, uh, after you sink, after you sink, your entry skills trigger once again because you're a mega. Non megas don't do this. It doesn't happen with non megas. It only happens with megas where when you come in again they trigger once once more so you're giving your whole team plus two crit and giving the opponents minus four uh physical attack and minus four physical defense just for uh existing basically <laughs> right uh there we go 42k uh, not too bad we didn't have all the um we didn't have all the multipliers in there right because again this isn't we're just going for more of a dps um build over here right uh, let's see if this, uh, Iron Head's decent, hopefully. Uh, 90,000 <laughs> on a super effective up Iron Head, but still. <laughs> but still, right? Um, oh my god. In Master Mode with, uh, with... I think we're doing the round 3 parameters and also, obviously, HP. So no defense stuff, right? So no, no defense stuff. And there's 16k. <laughs> Which is, uh, this is just nutty, man. This is just, this is just... This is just, this is just funny. This is just funny. <laughs> All right, let's get the Seal Witch back up over here. We get an extra nuke in. Would be uh, kind of funny as well, right? So, yeah, we didn't even, we didn't even get a like, support EX in. You know what, instead of sinking, instead of sinking, let's get a support EX in. Let's get a support EX nuke in, and then go for an Iron Head. Super effective up Iron Head on what? What was our, um, sync here now? I don't, I don't even know. Um, a third sync with all the setup? <laughs> uh, we, we don't even have our max multipliers. We could, uh, 
get minus one more um, physical attack for the for the max power posture, I guess. Uh, not power posture. What was the other one? I think it is power posture, right? Yeah, yeah, pa power posture. The 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 sink one is pecking on 40, 40,000. <laughs> on an iron head. Insane damage on the iron heads, right? On top of the insane damage on the nukes. On top of setting steel zone, which makes your other teammates deal even more nutty damage. On top of debuffing the opponent's attacks. On top of debuffing the opponent's defenses will make your te physical teammates do more damage. On top of flinching the opponent, <laughs> right? Uh, this is this is just funny. This is just funny. Uh, let's let's try this again. Let's go for a uh, sync like fully sync nuke build over here, All right? And uh, see how uh, see how that one goes. Um. The slight issue here is, I guess we uh, probably have to swap. You know what? Let's let's go for the let's go for the nuke on second sink because second sink is where we actually could get like the full nuke in with the, this comp, right? We want the extra super uh, effective up. Um, because again, she is more of a long battle, longer battle unit, right? Like she's fine in shorter battles. She would destroy. She's destroyed two K master mode, right? Uh, but she is generally just a bit better uh suited for longer battles just to the uh you know due to the nature of of, of how the unit works right okay let's get some uh defense debuffs here get the uh rough buff in uh let's grow. let's not try to kill him too hard here Let's not, let's not kill him too hard here. Let's just chill a bit. So, we're not gonna steal this here. Actually, should we just go for a support EX here? Uh, let's go for support EX here again. Alright, let's see. So, we, uh, again, go for second sync so we could, uh, set up the setup, um, a bit more, right? Not that she can't go for a fully set up first sync, but I do want to go second sync so we get support EX buff. We also get the, uh, extra, you know, um, Super effective up from Snorlax. She also does have super effective up on her own grid, but that would require her like spamming growl, which I mean, I guess we're doing anyways. <laughs> but still, right? Anyways, uh, these guys aren't really doing anything. Um. Okay, let's get the uh, last growl in. They're gonna sure hit all. Okay, what, whatever I guess. Um. Get a growl in. We can let him sink. Even though I guess we could sink here, but you know we want we want seal wish here, right? We want seal wish here, and here we go. Here we should have um all the stuff set up in terms of first sink nuke, and we'll see how it is. We'll see how it is, right? With uh, pecking order, the sink move power up nodes, metallic surge five, which is an extra fifty percent as well, right? So that's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of stuff. Sweetheart Seal Impact. And yeah, I uh, honestly wouldn't, didn't expect anything less. Did not expect anything less from a 99 than 99k. This isn't even EX, by the way. This is not even EX. This is not EX uh, Marnie. This is just a uh, you know, regular Marnie. This is not even EX Marnie. <laughs> not even EX Marnie, folks. Not even EX yet. We'll try out EX as well. I'm definitely tempted to EX her, so... Oh my goodness. Nah, this unit's nutty. Like, yeah, theoretically, you know, you could use Steel Zone to buff the other Steel types that you run her with, which makes them stronger, but... Or you could just completely bulldoze the opponent by yourself, right? You completely bulldoze destroy the opponent by yourself. Alright, let's, let's try, uh, let's try, let's try 2k over here. Let's do a 2k run real quick. Let's see what we could do. Uh... No status, some of this. Uh, honestly, I feel like I could give them sync move countdown as well. Like, what are they, what are they really going to do with that, right? <laughs> okay. Let's see. Uh, give them... Uh, uh, need 500 more points. We do strength plus three and strength plus two. All right, we'll do that. We'll do that with uh, with her friend Marnie here. Let's, uh, let's, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. 2K master mode. We allegedly, oh my god, this is so hard. Thing, right? 
Okay, let's get the Shouted Out in. Um, probably get a Growl in as well. Let's see. Um, uh, probably afford a Rock Smash there as well, right? Ouch, but it's Sonya, so not really. Steel Wish in there. God, Sonya's so good. <laughs> hey, they have the, uh, the, the Galar theme skull as well, look at that. <laughs> On top of everything else. Okay, if you're wondering, yo, isn't Sync Move kind of a bit risky with all this attack? You're gonna like, you know, let them sink early? Well, that's not really gonna happen, because I highly doubt, I highly doubt they're gonna be able to sink. I highly doubt they're gonna be able to sink. Right? Here's the Mega Mawile, which by the way, Mega Mawile, one of the rare Mega Pokemon designs that I actually like, because there's a lot of Mega Pokemon designs I actually don't like, but Mega Mawile, one of the rare ones that I actually love a lot. I do like quite a bit. All right, so uh, let's get a potion in here. Oh, I hit the wrong side. Oops. Oh, well then. Shouldn't be much of an issue. I mean, they're both one shot, so. <laughs> what are they gonna do, right? What are they actually gonna do over here to us? What are they realistically gonna do to us? Um, Steel Zone is about to run out. Can we get a Iron Head in before it completely runs out? And the answer is yes, there we go. Got one in before it completely ran out. <laughs> Anyways, uh, that's me on this one, I guess. I uh, hope you all enjoyed it. Marty by herself, um, even without Steel Zone to help other Steel type teammates, absolutely just unreal. Uh, but obviously, she's gonna get even even better with uh, some really key, powerful Steel Zone teammates. So uh, we'll check those out later. Um, in my opinion, one of the top duos in the game right now would be Marnie and Alolan Grimsey. Those two units are just nutty together right especially in, in legendary gauntlet so uh, we'll, we'll, we'll check that uh out later um we'll probably x her as well um i'm also gonna go do the story hopefully the story is good we'll uh we'll have our weekly mass mode run out here as well so have fun folks i'll let you guys know if i could stream legendary gauntlet tomorrow i really 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 want to but again i have a lot of homework to do unfortunately so um have fun folks hope you all enjoyed it and um i'll see you guys in the next one Casual max damage nuke.